Hey guys, Mitty here, continuing the Ascension Classes review, today I have a special guest that will do it for me. Meet me from the past reviewing Ascension Sorceries from Korea. A slightly different voice, still decent verdict and good commentary. Enjoy! Hey guys, Mitty here, in this video I will talk about newly released Absolute Sorcerers, her skills, PvE, PvP and Siege. So sit back, relax and enjoy! I was very excited to see her absolute form and so far she got pretty enhanced and I from now can say that she is better than awakening form in many aspects. So first of all let's talk about her skills. Nothing really changed from her pre-awakening form, the skills just got enhanced and slightly changed the animation. First skill are spikes, good skill for PvE, second is let's say a tornado. Amazing skill with immunity, heal and knockdown. Third, we have another good PvE skill and sometimes useful for PvP, as it shreds enemies damage. Fourth is the strongest sword skill, Mega Bomb with immunity, range and knockdown, does a lot of damage. Fifth is the Raven, blink with immunity and stun, good initiator and surprisingly good damage. Sixth, we have the ranged shot, quite useless for its low damage output though can be used to harass in PvP. Seventh is the best immunity skill on Sorg with micro stun. Eighth, long range dark spear that knocks down your opponent. Ninth, it's a ultimate that does two blinks and does great damage, immunity and knockdown of course. And the final buff as always crit overcut, heal and other buffs. The cast is quite fast though. As I said, the skills are all the same from pre-awakening form, but faster and stronger. Moving on to PvE, she has no troubles here, very fast spot clear, same goals for family dungeon and boss fights. I approve. For Siege, I would prefer Awakening Sorg, as her skill set is better. In any case, Absolute Sorg still can be quite useful for Siege. And for the final part of this video will be PvP. Sorceress is very mobile class, with great damage output and some range skills that makes her great for PvP, though not enough to be on the first spot. I would rank her maybe 5th, but I still need some better tests to decide. I wasn't expecting less from Sorg, amazing class, but maybe I expected a little bit more, at least a frontal block for example would be great for her kit, but not this time. And that's it for me guys, for the Sorg, I will leave you here with some PvP matches. Hope you enjoyed my commentary, make sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe. Have a nice day guys and enjoy the PvPs. Dreaming. Are we dreaming? Are we dreaming? Are we dreaming?